Uh, you know you're about to exit the Goldilocks zone, right? Yes. I don't care anymore. Um, but wait! What about your Earthlings? They don't care about me. But you care about them! Come on! You're not thinking straight! My Earthlings have been looking for a way to leave me for a long time now, okay? Nobody should be close to me. Nobody wants to, so I'll just do them a favor and speed up the process. Hey, come on, stop! I'll... If you get any closer, I'll... Shoot a solar flare? I don't care. NASA dude, what's the status? Okay, so the Earth is moving away from the Goldilocks zone at a steady pace. And what pace is that? Look at it this way. The Goldilocks zone is about 0.95 and 1.37 astronomical units. Let's pretend I don't know what that is. An astronomical unit is the distance between the Earth and the Sun. Which is? 93 million miles. Okay, phew, so we have time. Uh, sir, we're currently heading towards the Sun at uh, 1 million miles per hour. Just tell me how much time we have before we exit the Goldilocks zone! Uh, less than five hours. My God! Earth? Earth? Come on, there's no sound in space. Yeah, and planets can't talk or move outside their orbits. We've been ignoring the laws of physics for a while now, okay? I'm sorry. I'm... I know, you're worried. I'm just not used to talking to moons. All oh, right, you don't. Yeah, I'm moonless. This is literally the closest I've ever been to having a moon. Huh? Ugh, don't say it like that. What? You don't have a moon. It's not like we're your property. Hey, whoa, I didn't mean it like that. Planets have moons and moons have planets. It's a two-way system in my eyes, uh, the same way we have a sun and the sun has planets. If only everyone could see it that way. I think the other planets just don't think about it, because they're comfortable with the way things are. Well, look where that got them. Right now, there's an entire moon revolution building up, and they want to destroy the Earth to send a message or something. Wait, what? Hold on. That's... I see the Earth! Earth! You're way off your orbit! I told you to leave, Moon. Go and orbit someone else. Wait, are you... Are you heading towards the sun? Everyone will be happier, okay? You, Venus, Mars, my Earthlings, everyone will be- That's not true! Listen, we- Just leave me alone! I told you he was unstable! I'm sorry! Hey, have you heard about our good friend Patreon? Up, 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 don't skip just yet. Just hear me out. Our team has made a challenging decision. We want to post longer videos more often. We want content that you enjoy, not stuff the algorithm tells us you want. Otherwise, our channel would look something like this. I've sent all my humans into space, and the first to colonize a planet wins a bazillion dollars! Okay, that's actually pretty cool. But you get the point. By supporting our Patreon, you'll help us to make three long videos every month, plus all the amazing rewards we have for you. But narrator guy, I don't know what those rewards are. Well, how about early content? This video has been on Patreon for some time now. Behind the scenes, deleted scenes, your name in the credits, tutorials by the creators on how to make an animated show, and an exclusive look at the development of the Astro Dude movie. And can you tell me the tiers, narrator guy? Of course! Comet, Moon, Planet, and Star. Each with their own unique rewards so everyone can join our mission. Any support is always welcome. However, keep in mind that the higher tiers have a limited number of people that can join. So if you're interested, you better be quick. Thanks to all the Patreons that already support us. And to the new ones, welcome to the team. All right, back to the video! So, yeah. Once we're out of the Goldilocks zone, the Earth will become too hot to live on, we'll be receiving crazy amounts of radiation, and... Guys, in short, we all must evacuate the planet. Only five hours until the world is uninhabitable? How do you expect us to evacuate the planet? Correction, we have two hours. Took me some time to put this presentation together. What? Well, I guess we're all screwed. I'm gonna go and prepare for the end. Yeah, me, me too. Not so fast. We have spy satellites, you know. We know about your contingency plan. Uh, what are you talking about? Uh, we all have huge rockets prepared for an occasion like this. Wait, all of you? Well, the great powers at the very least. Do you have space for me? Build your own rocket, Peru. Oh, come on! Let me into your ship! Hey, I don't have anything to do for you! If you don't let me in your spacecraft, we'll take it! Hey, let me in your ship! Let me in your ship! <laughs> 
Silence! Uh, the Earth is speeding up, so we have 30 minutes. I guess my work here is done. Listen to us! I don't want to! Well, you're going to either way! Now, Moon! What are you doing? Drifting you off this path! Stop it! At least let me do this right! My Earthlings are already preparing to escape. I know they've been building spaceships to escape. I know everything they do. I feel everything they do, all the time. They'll be better off without me. You all will. That's not true! Whoa! trying so hard because we want you to try what you're doing is not a solution it feels like a solution it's not you know it's not i'm in pain all the time earth we can't possibly know what it is like to be you but please give yourself a chance to be happy to be better what do you mean i can't go to space I'm telling you, the world's about to... Gah, bye! Your boss doesn't want you to leave the planet? He says this end-of-the-world business is nonsense! Ugh, even now I can't go to space! Hey. What? Despite everything you do, you're not a terrible person. Uh, thanks. Neither are you. <laughs> I know. I always thought having life made me special. I thought you all liked me because of it. And when I thought other planets or moons could have life, I... You felt insecure and made a mess of things. Yes. Then apologize and stop defining yourself on one thing. It's too late. It's not. However, it is hard. But we know you can do it. You say you're in pain and it's all so difficult all the time, but weren't there moments where it felt like it was all worth it? I... I... Earth? Are you okay? Hey, the Earth and I are neighbor planets! In fact, why shouldn't we be friends? You tried more than anyone to develop life, and you succeeded and achieved your dreams! <sighs> Jeez, man. I'm sorry. I just got deep. Um, you wanna keep playing cards? I... I want to try to be... better. almost turned into a red giant from all this stress! Wait, the... the Earth is returning? woo We're not gonna die! Oh, yeah! Oh, oh. space is so freaking weird. Wait, the world's not ending anymore? Huh, that's cool, I guess. What now? Now we get to work! It's not gonna be easy. It wouldn't be worth it if it was. I know it's probably too late to say this, but I'm- Apology accepted, Earth. 